so much. I had to work my ass off that I'd share a, um, what is it called? A term with you guys. A Kiko term. A Kiko definition. This is Kiko's Dictionary. Remember, I had a couple words for you guys and I explained them to you about the way I speak and uh, my dictionary of things and like all that, like what the terms mean that I use. So I'm going to give you a Kiko Dictionary term. Uh, it's a term that I've came up with since I've been in um, South Carolina. Yes, it's hot out here and I am sweating my ass off because I've been working all morning since 3 o'clock this morning. And I've been doing stuff and I went to sleep at 1. So I didn't get very much sleep, um, but I'm going to give you this Kiko term. Okay, Kiko term of the day is peacocking. It's a South Carolina term. Well, at least it got adopted in South Carolina from Kiko. So uh, Kiko's definition for peacocking is when you have a room full of people, but you try to cause a problem. Uh, you have a bunch of people over your house, and then you try to bring up an issue. That way you have a lot of witnesses. Um, like, oh, if you got a problem with me and then we can handle this, but you got a house full of people that you can see stuff, you know, and they can see stuff and be witnesses, you know what I mean? Like, that's called peacocking. It's like when you pretend that you want a problem, but you really don't want a problem, so you make a big ass scene or you, uh, bring a lot of witnesses or something like that. Like, uh, I don't know. The way I was raised, we don't do things in front of people. That way, uh, there's no witnesses, but, um, peacocking is when... Like, uh, okay, so, for instance, I was at a gas pump, right? And uh, there's this big dude there, and he was going off, and I came out the 7-Eleven wondering what the fuck he was going off about, and he was mad that I was parked in front of a diesel gas pump, which I, I shouldn't have been, but at the same time, he, he came at me crazy, yelling and screaming and waving his hands around and stuff, and hey, I ain't got time for all that. And honestly, I ain't fucking on that level no more. I'm trying to be a Buddhist, and motherfuckers keep fucking on my piece. So, you know what? I called the police. Police came out and dealt with the man, right? Um, so, anyways, this, the definition came from that guy, basically. Well, it came from him and a couple other people because a couple other people did the same shit, but they didn't do it as extreme as he did it. This guy, he was screaming and hollering and waving his hands. I come out the gas station and I'm like, what the fuck is this guy doing? And that's when it popped in my mind. Peacocks do the same thing. They make a big ass scene and they're loud and they cause fucking a lot of people to watch and stuff. So that way, if anything happens, they got witnesses. He's peacocking me. He's fucking strutting his feathers around, fucking making a big scene. He even had a couple of people side in with him, like going to people's cars and shit. Like, yeah, yeah, this motherfucker right here parked in front of the diesel gas pump, blah, blah, blah. Man, peacocking, you know what I mean? Making witnesses so in case something really happens which you didn't want something to really happen but in case something does really happen and then you can peacock it you could have witnesses you know what i mean so that's my term for peacock and i don't know if there really is a definition for peacocking or if it really means something but that's what it means to me if i say yeah that motherfucker was peacocking me well he was making a big ass scene so that way he could look tough but not actually have to be tough, you know. So he can make a big ass scene in front of everybody and cause everybody to side in and, and like fucking have witnesses in case something happens. That's called peacocking, okay? So making a scene because you want to look tough, but you really don't want to do nothing, or else you would have caught that person on the deal away from all the witnesses. That's peacocking.